on guys boost the whips here i'm gonna be installing today a new uh trunk spoiler uh it's a very aggressive one so i'm gonna reveal it to you guys once i've done cleaning here i already went ahead and i removed the jdmv type that i had on here to remove it i had to use a plastic squeegee to kind of get in the front and back sides until it finally came off and now the next step to go ahead and remove this remaining 3m i'm gonna go ahead and use a plastic uh gillette and it's very easy i'm just going to show you a little bit all you have to do is kind of lift and kind of cut this doesn't uh damage your uh, your paint you just got to make sure you don't add too much pressure just enough to kind of lift it And that's what you'll be doing for the rest of the uh, 3M. And then after any of this little residue comes off with a 3 hesion pr promoter. Or you can also use a rapid cleaner or a goo gun to kind of remove that extra adhesive on the actual uh, paint. I'm going to go ahead and finish up here. And then I'll show you guys how to prep the uh, next spoiler. Alright guys, I went ahead and I already cleaned it the most I can. You may see a little bit of residue here and there, but that's not a problem. It's very thin. What you want to make sure is that you have a clean touch feel. And the reason I'm not cleaning this off any further is just because the other sport is going to rest on here. And I'm going to put some adhesion promoter here. So it should take off the rest of the adhesive that you see here. So as you guys can see, if you do decide removing your sport, spoiler you're gonna have a lot of holes so you need a spoiler that is gonna cover or go over this that way you're not getting water in what you can also do is plug them and uh, that will do it so I'm gonna go ahead and prep now the new spoiler and reveal it to you guys so you guys can see this is gonna be the new spoiler It's a full carbon fiber uh, turbo tan does offer this I believe on eBay you can find it way cheaper so uh, but this is it. I don't know what it's really called, but it's a full real carbon fiber. A wing. It's not on there yet. I was just doing positioning. And just so that I can reveal it to you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and prep it now. Um, and then uh, we'll take it from there. I went ahead and I already put the 3M on it. I bought my own self real 3M adhesive for this and uh, this is what I'm doing so I did a few strips as you guys know I already peeled some of it this is so that I can position it once I have it positioned on the vehicle I can go ahead and start pulling the strips and start pressing down that way you can secure the spoiler so I'm gonna go ahead and do that now and I'll show you guys how it looks the end result all right guys there you have it this is from a side profile I'm gonna take one from the back and then on the other side and maybe one from the top view so you guys can see um, how the spoiler looks and uh, we'll wrap this video up. I think it looks really aggressive. It looks really great, actually. I had mixed feelings in the beginning, but I gotta tell you, it just makes the car look super aggressive. Here's a shot from the back. Um, really nice. It actually uh, goes and blends in with my roof spoiler from that line. I think it looks great, guys. Uh, definitely another great option for the uh, spoiler on the Accord. I'm gonna give it another side shot on the other side just so that we can play around with the sun glares and uh, that way you guys can appreciate the spoiler much better. Good shot at the spoiler. Looking real nice with the whole setup, with the whole gunmetal look, uh, with the tail lights, everything just starting to come uh, much better into play. Uh, really looks nice and uh, yeah. I'm gonna give one last final shot from a top view type of angle so you guys can see how the fitment looks and then uh, we'll wrap this up. This is from the top view. Let me know what you guys think. Leave your comments below and uh until next time guys like share and subscribe as always boost the whips i'm out have a very pleasant day and god bless and stay safe